Hey everyone, this is Tom. It's Friday, um, probably about 9.30, 10, and it is hot. We are experiencing quite a heat wave here in Ohio, <clears throat> so I'm trying to get out early-ish. Uh, it's nice, there's, there's kind of a haze, um, high cloud cover, so it's not real bright out, so I can, I can get started earlier here. So this is a field that um, Jenny and I have hunted, and we found a couple celts here, a couple decent points. Um, and I'm looking at something on the ground that's uh, best find of the year so far for me. Take a look at this. That's right how she laid. Right on top like that. Wow. So first thing I'm going to do is check out, check out that tip. And it is, I think it's worked that way. Not real familiar with that material. Not real familiar with that point type. With this crazy looking base here. Look at that. Well, that's what I came out here for this morning. If I don't find anything else all day, it'll be a good day. But if I do, we'll get the camera back on. Okay, we're back. <clears throat> it's funny, I don't know if you have um, friends, relatives, people that say, oh, I'd love to find an arrowhead, but I don't know how you guys ever find those things out in the field like that. Look how far away. Um, I can't see it through my viewfinder, but... I'm guessing you can see that. Where is it? Let me know if you see it. <laughs> it's right on top. That would been killer. Man. Snapped right in half. Can't tell if it's an old break, but it's pretty sharp. Okay. Hopefully more to come. I'll get back to you. Okay. I just hunted that little hill down there, and uh, I'm up here on the big hill, and instead of starting on one side, I decided just to walk right down the middle of it, because um, I'm going to go take 20 minutes and sit in the shade. <laughs> Maybe I'm showing my age. But So I just picked a row. Just picked a row to come up off the top of the field, across the top of the field, and uh, maybe this is a false alarm. Looks like a tip to me. How about you? <clears throat> wow. A little pressure there. Okay. What do we have here? <coughs> Excuse me. Looks like uh, some sort of leaf blade. Yeah, I don't see anything broke on the bottom of that. It's just, that's just the shape. All right. Well, obviously, I'm going to come back and hunt this hill after I take a little break and uh, get out of the get out of the extreme sun. I'll get back to you. Okay. Decided to take a little break here in the shade. Now, it's nice to have the top off the Jeep, except it doesn't give you any shade. So you gotta find the shade but uh, yeah it's only 84 degrees but the real feel is 96 it is humid all right but I'm gonna get back out there and see what else I can find 
Okay, it's definitely not getting any cooler out here. Uh, looks like I got a broke here. Yeah, I'll say it's broke. So this is all fractured the whole way down here. I bet that was an impact fracture that took off a lot of that and a little piece of the base here. But yeah, that would have been nice. That's pretty color. Okay. Well, I won't be out too much longer, but uh, I've got a little bit of the field left, and uh, if I find anything else, I'll get back to you. Okay, here's a quick look at uh, this weekend's finds. Uh, let's see, a couple I didn't video. Uh, I was out yesterday, um, didn't find much. Uh, one of my fields that I like to look, and this was all that came out of there. Uh, this one I didn't film the other day. thought it was a flake. Um, but I don't think that was flake, just flaked that way. I think it's worked that way. Some sort of perforator. Here's that uh, broken piece, probably an Adena. It's got this crazy fracture. Again, I think it was hit here on the tip. Broke it back this way, took off part of the base. Nice material on that one. Um, is that blade? Then I think that's that's the way that one was made. Got a nice bevel beds there. Too bad on this. I think it's probably Jack's Reef. Would be my guess. Yeah, but it did come up with a good one. Really nice flaking on that. A little different material. Not quite sure what that is. Um, and that flared base, it's a little different looking as well. So I probably could have spent some time looking through the flint type book, but pretty sure it's archaic, some sort of archaic point. But, yeah, so we're, um, yeah, we're close to being done with surface hunting this year. Um, we're talking about opening up, back up the uh, wood site, maybe doing some digging here in July. So, yeah, well, uh, well certainly if we get back out there, we will let you know, um, yeah, we'll take the camera along and let you know what we find. Okay, thanks for tuning in. This is Commissioner Tom signing off.